to it. Welcome to Fabulous Homes TV. I promise you this is the best 30 minutes that you guys are going to spend watching TV for a while. So here we are. I wanted to let you guys know about what we have coming. We want to cover a little bit of inspiration. We want to know that after you're done watching this show, you will get that pep in your step that makes you get off your couch and say, hey, I want to go change my purpose and I want to make something happen with my life. Right? So we're going to touch on some inspiration. We're also are going to touch on my favorite topic, which is real estate. Of course, you guys know you have to get to your own home. And we're going to teach you simple little guides that can get you from where you are right now to your home. All right? We're also going to touch on some education. We believe financial literacy is like super important. I uh, need to give you guys little tips and little, you know, tidbits here and there to get you guys from where you are right now also to where you need to be because at the end of the day we want you guys to build wealth we want to empower you guys we want to empower our whole nation diana right we can't be expecting all this oil we're not prepared you know via the education to know how to manage your wealth when you get it right then we're going to touch on some fashion you guys know one of my other passion and fashion so i really love that aspect so we're going to touch on some fashion we're going to touch on some entertainment and we are also going to touch on some current updates and news what is going on in and around wonderful diana so i want you guys to shoot in it's going to be exciting it's going to be one of those 30 minutes that you're going to enjoy you're going to look forward to it consistently every single week and we can't wait to you guys in the other end of the screen. Bye now. Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome to Fabulous Homes TV. This is episode number 55. I hope you guys had an awesome week that just passed. I know a lot of you are preparing for Valentine's and so I'm not being yet into the Valentine's thing yet till next week. But this is the episode of first and um of course you know when you guys think about first you might think about your first love you might think about the first time you bought a car well yeah let's say car right car your car or the first time you got your home or the first time something major happened in your life right i know let me let you you know take your mind back there right now but this entire episode we we're talking about the first of a lot of things that we did here at fabulous homes international guyana like the first company to actually pioneer um an affordable home ownership platform for all guyanese yes once you're committed to your commitment to home ownership then it becomes quite simple by giving you options such as the box hand program the layaway program you know you have an increment a 25 percent increment program you have you know what we call the do-it-yourself program you find we can create programs around your income yes and we have assisted so many families in making home ownership a possibility for so many of you and we were the first to do it right here in Guyana when a lot of people thought that what we were doing was kind of insane but that's good insane is always good um, when you're helping tons of people realize their dreams of home ownership and then we were the first as far as pioneering real estate yeah as far as the real estate Academy goes we're the first real estate school here in Guyana and our goal is to train graduate real estate professionals that are looking to really take the standards of real estate to another level here in this country and it has been phenomenal because now you're having graduate professionals that are on their own not just some hustler or some higgler as i could call it out there just trying to see grab 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 see what i could take who i could defraud all that good stuff no that in a few years from now it will be non-existent but this is the episode of first so go back with us as we go through this entire episode See them trying to fight me down Lord why, Lord why, Lord why, why? They trying their best to keep me down Lord why, Lord why, Lord why Father please help me now Gotta protect me now Yeah, 
from the eyes of my enemies, Lord. As I go out on my road, do not leave me exposed. Give me the power to find it. Pull up my foot and trample it. about owning your very own home? If you answered yes, then rush down to Fabulous Homes International Guyana office located at 189 Church and Waterloo Street. We're at a four-story building at the corner of Church and Waterloo Street. Or if you're in New Amsterdam, check out our office on the second floor of the Gordons Mall in New Street, New Amsterdam. Call us today on 592-615-8740 or 592-609-8233 or for overseas guys and girls, call 1-855-232-5550 or go online to www.fabulousholmesinternationalguyana.com or www.fhigy.com. Com. That's www.fhigy.com. Together we can. Jama Cafe GT. Authentic Jamaican and Caribbean cuisine at its finest. Yes, we know GT food is the best. Now that you know that, come and try the rest. Located at 189 Church Street, that's on the corner of Church and Waterloo Street, that's the third floor of the Fabulous Homes office building. Make sure you stop by and like our page on Facebook, which is Jamra Cafe Diana, and drop in to tantalize your taste buds. The atmosphere is pleasant, and the food is oh so good. And according to the chef, he said he'll make you numb off all your fingernails. Jamra Cafe GT, nothing but the best. If you're one of those many people thinking about taking the next step necessary to turn your home ownership dream into reality, then we can help you turn your thoughts into action. At Fabulous Homes International, we aim to change tenants into homeowners with a range of options to get you started or to help you continue on the path to home ownership. Welcome to Avalon Reserve, a new development coming to Friendship South on the east bank of Demerara. Choosing somewhere to live in Guyana can be a real challenge for those who find themselves torn between the hustle and bustle of the city life and the powerful emotion and sense of well-being conjured when one lives in an area imbued in natural beauty. We have something right up your alley. Here is Avalon Reserve, a new development coming to Friendship South, just half an hour drive away from the capital along the eastern bank of the Demerara River. You will find this beautiful, pristine gem presently under development over the next years. Our intention is to transform this space into a thriving, vibrant community. Now, when we decided, right, like after that four years of coming up with a plan that could actually work for the masses and we sat down and we were ready to execute this plan the only thing that was missing was where are we gonna put the people now right and we did have Spring Hill which was the first community that we see we we're gonna develop 
but it was way up the highway and uh, a lot of the feedback that we get from our customers is like oh my god Dr. K, you know, we still work in Georgetown, we have our businesses in Georgetown, and it will be a little hectic for us to get from there to Georgetown every single day. So as we are on a track to find the perfect piece of property for us to develop a community um, that could accommodate all of our current clients that didn't have land, that were looking to own a piece of property, but not just the land, because there are tons of people with, oh, that has land already, right? So we wanted to give them house and land together but we also wanted to make it affordable so that they could afford it on their regular salary so let's look back at what we found when we got to Avalon and I know a lot has changed over the years and oh my goodness at the rate that we're that we're developing this community you guys have to go see it of course but we're gonna give you a little sneak peek of what it looked like then when we had no roads when we had nothing but dirt and bush and jungle and now we have a thriving developing community and it was a first because that's going to be the first private uh, real estate development that can accommodate over 1500 families that is going to call Avalon a friendship home so let's check it out in our beautiful developing community Avalon and Friendship South. It's a thousand plus, but let's say 1500 home community that we're currently developing here. The homes are from moderate income earners. That's from moderate like $8 million and up. So you have the moderate income, you have moderate high, and then we have high income earners that are going to be part of this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful development. Upon completion, this will be one of the best places to live in Guyana, bar none. Don't worry with all the stuff that you see around here. Have you ever seen that developing community? Remember when Diamond started? The water was still in the 90s, right, when we got in here. And look what it is today. And we're not even doing a Diamond. We're doing Avalon, which is like by first world standard, by, you know, standards that we built. So we want to get you into a home that you will love living in. Yes, that's the key. Is that just to just throw up some 
something. We just want to make sure that you enjoy the video. Do you see our minis? Yes, we had that on promotion for over a year for five million dollars. Can you believe that? It was like we were giving away the houses because that's what everybody was saying. Hey, why are you guys are giving away the houses? But we wanted you to come and take advantage of the opportunity that was presenting itself, and that included land at that time. Yes. Yeah, so now I really want you to kick yourself. Do that. Yes, kick yourself because you had an opportunity, you did not take it. So now, as you can see. Beautiful, beautiful homes. There are two bedroom, two story homes. And there is space downstairs for your living, kitchen, dining, if you want to do like an open bar type setting. It's not a good regular size traditional diner house, but it's perfect for a first time family, a retiring person that doesn't want a whole lot of space. It's perfect for them. And now that house is $8 million. It's going up again this year. And there are different sizes. So you have that that is 8 million and you have the next size up that is a thousand square feet for 10 million and then you have the mini income generator which is similar to this but it comes with two apartments of um a two bedroom apartment upstairs and then downstairs comes with two one bedroom apartment and you can do that for just 18 million guyana dollars right now that's about ninety thousand dollars yes Okay, well, you know, we always uh, about some excitement and stuff, right? But we have to go to like, you know, the first home that was built in our beautiful developing community. We're not going to say pre anymore. Developing community, I've learned that friendship. And of course, can you imagine being the first homeowner at Avalon? Yes, um, the first homeowner is an awesome, awesome gentleman. And his house is just spectacular. And it was made just for him right so we can't wait for when you guys have an opportunity to start moving in as soon as all of the remaining infrastructure work is done but guys this was the first this is what kicked it off this is what started the community and let's take you now to see the first home of course there were more than one but this is the one that kicked it all off let's take you to see it now hey guys welcome to our three bedroom model now this particular model is one of my usual 7,000 or say between 5,000 to 7,000 square feet model. But this customer liked that plan so much that we decided to make it into what we call luxury and a budget. So we took that big house and we just made it smaller. So come take a look at this one. This is three bedrooms with one bath. It does come with a huge kitchen and a breakfast nook area there's a little adjustment that has to be made to this particular model but it's gorgeous so check it out with me this particular plan like I tell every last one of you you can have it customized to suit your individual taste and your individual style you don't exactly have to do it as you see it here you can always arrange it differently so in this model you have your huge bedroom in the front right and for some people they can make this into their master and remember guys the houses are not 100 percent finished okay so don't quarrel and tell me oh my god it looks like if you know it needs a lot more work yes it does about five percent more to get it to the point where it's actually fully fully finished so you'll see no errors period right now i'm seeing a lot of stuff that you have to do right but this particular room you can make it into your master all right if you choose to if not as you're walking out of this first big bedroom you're coming into your hallway that takes you to your bathroom and remember as i told you it's luxury on a budget so you are having in this particular model you get a bathtub plus you have the fitting for your shower and all that good stuff so it's like a two-in-one and where do you see that anywhere in Guyana? Have you ever seen in a house that is 12 million in Guyana? That's like 60,000 US, right? You have a bathtub with a shower enclosure as opposed to just a little blind to across your front of your bathroom, right? So you guys should really get excited as to the type of details that we're putting into these homes, even though you're not spending 40 and 50 million dollars. 
This is your second bedroom. That's for your kid if you have any. So you have kid bedroom number one, and to the left of that you have another huge bedroom which you could have made into your master if you chose to, or you could make it into a kid's bedroom. But the front room and the third room are the big, the largest rooms. So you can choose if you would like to add that and make it into a master or not. But all of the rooms are sizable. They can hold up to a king size bed with your two nightstand, with your dress and your mirror. Of course, we can stage everything for you guys. Off of the living room, we do have your kitchen and your breakfast nook. It is also sizable, but like I said, some rearranging has to be done. The covers are not finished yet. We're working, so work in progress. But at least you have an idea as to what can be done for you in this three bedroom model. And this model also comes with a garage. And I'm sure you probably got it from the outside. The door opens on the other side. So here you go. I'm gonna let the camera do that for you. So you can see the garage that this comes with. So you're actually coming out of your garage. So you have your groceries and everything. You open your door and you come straight through into your kitchen. Right? So you don't have to walk around to the front door to do any of that stuff and be toting stuff into your kitchen. So, like I said, it's a big house, but the model for this particular plan is one of my 4,000 to 7,000 square feet, but we made it under 2,000 square feet so that you can have a really lovely house. We proudly present the Oasis Country Club community here in beautiful Guyana, embracing renewable energy and a green economy. We aim to ensure our homeowners save money on their energy needs while leaving the smallest carbon footprint possible. Guyana is evolving and with these changes comes growth, prosperity and major development in the public and private sector. So come home every day to paradise at the Oasis, where affordable luxury meets fine detailing in this enclave of a single family home community. Our modern floor plans are designed for the way your family lives. We offer superior quality homes in an amazing natural environment, nestled in the mainland, overlooking the Mazaruni River. Conveniently near Bartika, the gateway to Guyana, pristine hinterland. Reserve your piece of paradise today while there are still house lots available. Call us today on 592-615-8740 or 592-609-8233 or call our office line at 592-223-0340 or for our overseas folks, you guys can call 1-855-232-5550. go to our motivation yes yes and y'all already know my favorite favorite motivator of all times mr les brown um one of his stories were about a time when he beat cancer right and of course that was the first time finding out and that would have been devastating to to the average man to any man for that matter of fact and the fact that he is beaten cancer for over 40 years is testament that cancer can actually be beaten but the whole point is that how he reacted after the news and he's here still here standing some people die within a year once they find out about this dreadful disease but to know that there are people that have lived and have beaten cancer is awesome but it's not about sad stuff guys so don't go there don't go there he is beaten cancer so he's way up there in his late 60s 70s now and he's still living and he has been inspiring the masses around the world. And let's share a piece of his story with you. 
And I followed the program. I started taking wheatgrass, eating all kind of rabbit food, exercising, doing yoga, prayer. Somebody said that cancer cells are cells going crazy. You've got to mobilize your mind and spirit and get stress out of your life and just calm yourself and get centered and, and begin to focus on healing yourself. Disease, dis-ease, there's dis-ease in your body. So it's necessary that you start making good choices in terms of your eating habits. Everything I put in my mouth says to my body, I plan to be here. And we have to start moving. I read where just exercise alone three times a week will decrease by 30% one getting cancer or decrease by 32% cancer spreading three times a week. Well, I said, wait a minute. They say I have prostate cancer. So I started exercising three times a day, seven days a week. I wanted to say to my body, I'm serious. I don't plan to have cancer for the rest of my life. This is not going to take me out. So the other thing that's important is ask for help. Not because you're weak, but you want to remain strong. And ask for help and don't stop until you get it. And so I started talking to other people who had gone through my experience and we became support for each other. It's very important that we start talking and sharing and communicating our fears and our reservations and, and looking at different options. I, I, I decided to take an option after examining a lot of things that I felt that had the minimum amount of risk for me and that would be suitable for me and for my lifestyle of traveling and doing all the things that I do. The other thing that's important is not only must you mobilize your mind and spirit and have a regiment for yourself of prayer and meditation, of exercise, of eating correctly, of, of taking a variety of herbs. And I mean, I took everything. Well, which ones do you recommend? Well, I was taking so many, they were fighting inside of me. He said, get back. That's my job. No, no. Get back, Noni. No, come on, wheatgrass. You get back. Get back, salt, palmetto, and zinc, and vitamin E, and selenium. I mean, I was taking everything. Some days I say, eaty, beaty, body, boy. <laughs> I think the cancer say, wait a minute, this is a crazy man we're in here. We need to get out of here. He's going to kill everybody. So the other thing is, you got to have a sense of humor. You got to laugh. I, I never tell you what. <laughs> you, if you don't learn to laugh at yourself, it, it's um, in this, and sometimes you have to laugh to keep from crying, it will drive you crazy. Now, so I find a lot of things laugh at. Don't let the little kid die within you. I laugh quite a lot. So, and I found out that just one minute of anger, according to the laws of psychoneuroimmunology, weakens your immune system for four to five hours. But one minute, one minute of laughter boosts your immune system for over 24 hours. I say, get out of here. So I laugh quite a lot. Okay, by the time you get through listening to this, you ain't gonna get sick for 10 years. <laughs>
Entering through the solid cherry wood front door, guests arrive in an elegant foyer, which features marble flooring, extensive millwork, custom drapery, and a cathedral coffered ceiling. A walk-in cloak closet off the front entrance provides plenty of convenient storage space. The light-filled main hall greets guests with windows overlooking the home's manicured side gardens. The coffered ceilings, crown mouldings, pilaster walls and marble floors throughout the main floor give an immediate impression of elegance and style. From the main hall, a recessed panelled archway leads through to the opulent living room. Here, music can be played through built-in invisible speakers while you enjoy the town and country gas fireplace and its carved limestone mantle. The breakfast area which adjoins the kitchen, main hall and family room features heated marble flooring, decorative pilaster walls and a French door leading out to the garden. Games room, home theatre, wine cellar and indoor swimming pool. In addition to an integrated hot tub, the swimming pool room also features a spa area which houses a dry and wet sauna. And guys, you know, you know, I love fashion, right? That's my other passion, by the way. That's my other passion. So this weekend is a Grammy weekend. So of course, for our fashion piece this week, we're just gonna look back at some of the the outfit that really, really stood out on last year red carpet at the Grammys. And I'm gonna pick my favorites. So check them out. Thanks. Okay, this is hard. I'm gonna go with Gaga, which I know is everyone's favorite look. I just thought this was her moment. She looked comfortable. She was among her people. It was about the music. I like. I thought this was her best look. Um, I love me some Janelle Monet. I think this is such a wonderful, bold choice, but Janelle Monet brings it and brings a bold choice every single time she steps on the red carpet. I agree with you more. I am dying to touch this dress. I want to know how those sleeves stayed up. I want to feel what is holding them and then touch all the ruffle. about Cardi B? Um, so Andrea, she went vintage. She brought back this gorgeous dress from French, French fashion de designer Thierry Mugler. Did yes. I get that right? You nailed it. Oh my God, I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me more about Mugler. it. Mugler, Mugler. Yes. Um, it's from 1995. It's couture. It's a work of art. Now, if you need to reach us, please call 592-227 1380 or 592-615-8740 or 592-609-8233 or for the overseas guys and girls call 1-855-232-5550 for those of you that are in Brooklyn you can always stop by 2174 Nostrand Avenue that's on the corner on the Flatbush Junction and ask her Miss Odetta King and she can assist you with all your home ownership needs here in Guyana and the rest of you can just go online to www.fabulousholmesinternationalguyana.com. That's www.fabulousholmesinternationalguyana.com. Or the short version, you can do fhigy.com. That's www.fhigy.com. For those of you that are on Facebook, please hit follow so that you guys can stay in the loop with everything fantastic that we're doing right here at Fabulous Homes. For those of you that are on YouTube, please hit subscribe and share, share, share the video with every one of your friends so that they too can get excited about returning to their beautiful home country, Guyana, which is now a petrol state. Until next weekend, guys. Bye, y'all.